Yo, what do you do, you do? Well, man, never Minecraft video. This video, we're going to be creating automatic Minecraft AFK XP farm. Super simple, super mm. easy to make. Let's just go over the functions before I start doing it. So it's basically zero tick, which this is bedrock, because I don't think Java can do zero tick, I'm not 100% sure on that. But basically, zero tick will cause the cactus to fall at an increased speed rate than it usually does. It can fill up these two chests with coal, which will then fill up these furnaces, which will then burn it. And you can stop these, and then once you stop these, you actually open it up and you collect whatever's in it, and then it'll give you XP. It's super quick and super easy to make, and while I'm making this, I'm actually going to have this one running, so we can see how much it does for us, and we'll go into survival mode and see how many levels it goes. So let's start making this farm. This farm, you're going to need uh, multiple things that are two pistons, two stick pistons, two cactuses, two furnaces, six sand, three levers, four glass, six chests, four redstone torches, nine hoppers, one to two stacks of a building block, can be any building block you want as long as it's solid, redstone repeater, and ten redstone. So this farm was created by, I forgot what his channel name was, but his channel is in the link down below, so make sure to check him out. I made some slight variations to his farm though. So starting things off, we're going to build a 5x1 line, so you're just building 5 blocks in a row. You're going to space, and then you're going to do one block away, and you're going to do another 5. And in between these gaps right here, here, you're going to place down sticky pistons, and where those sticky pistons are marked, on the opposite one, you're going to place down sand. And then what we are going to do, because that's making noise and I don't like that, but that's okay. We're going to create, we're going to fill this, these in basically. Fill these in, fill these in, fill these in, fill these in, fill these in. And then once you fill these in, you're going to dig down, you're going to break it, and you're going to kind of make a trench right here. Just for the heck of it, because why not? I don't, actually, you don't really have to do that. We're going to place a block here, and then you're going to place another one on top of that, and you're going to place it just like this. And then against the farm, so it has to be away from the pistons, you're going to place a torch, you're going to grab a lever, place the lever down, you can switch this and switch it on and off, place your repeater so it's facing into the pistons, and then a redstone torch, and this creates your system. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to place down all the blocks so it extends up to this piston, and then take redstone and connect it. This should extend these out, if it doesn't extend them out, you're doing something wrong. That's just something else. And actually now I think about it, you have to break this trench, so that has to be created. Now what you're going to do is you're going to stack the sand on top of the pistons, just like this, and then you can actually fill these areas in all the way up to the sand, all the way up throughout here and here. Don't do right here, leave the uh, actually yeah, that area open or it'll screw up your thing. You can fill this area in, fill it all the way around, boom, bam, bada, just like this just your idea this is what happens it just it's the same idea it's always been for it for it basically but now we're gonna do is you're gonna take two temporary blocks and place them down and then grab your regular pistons and place them here and then once you do that you can break these bottom blocks if you guys can guess this is where your cactus is going so grab your cactus and place it down here and here and then what you're gonna basically do is you're gonna fill in this area all the way, oops, not there. You're not going to fill in that area. You're going to fill in these areas right here, here, and here. Don't do what I did, basically, is what I'm trying to tell you as well. Actually, you can break down this layer. Get rid of this layer completely. And what, actually, hold on. You're going to need one block here. You're going to take a chest. Place the chest behind this, so it's basically a double chest right here. And then take your hopper and have one facing into the chest. And then the rest of the hopper is going into that other hopper. And then you can basically, you, know, you need to create a roof over it to finish this part off. Just create a roof surrounding it. Boom, boom, boom. And then you can fill in this area. You're going to have to fill in this area if I'm going to be honest with you. And then you can take your glass and put your glass all the way through this. Break these, whoops, break these top ones. You don't need these top ones anymore. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to place hoppers beneath these. So they're facing down. They have to face down into, you're going to face down into your furnaces. Is what you're basically doing. And then you're going to have ones extending out into your furnace. Whoops. This is going to be kind of a pain in my ass. There we go. And then we do it like this. And you're going to do the same exact thing on this side as well. 
basically this is where your coal is going to go. You're going to have a bunch of coal that will basically be put into these and it will go into the fueling part and then this will collect the cactus and it will create the burning sensation. And then you're going to put hoppers that go into this chest underneath the furnace and that's your collecting system all done and ready. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to place a block here and you're going to grab your torches and you're going to place your torches right here. It, if it doesn't turn off, then you're doing something wrong. Build a block up, place another one, build one more block up, and then you're going to just extend this all the way out throughout your chest. You can actually fill in these. Actually, no, you cannot. I forgot that cactuses are the biggest pain in the ass to place. But you can just extend this area out, fill it in with redstone all the way through, and then you want to put your cactuses back because I was not smart and I did not think about that. Because you know I'm big brain. Yeah. We'll turn on the farm. And then see what see what it isn't as quick as it used to be zero take it because obviously it's not going to be just due to some minor changes and stuff like that. But let's see what it takes for us here. Let's turn it off. And wow, that was wow, that was a lot of stuff. Like holy crap. So much. It gave us over a stack and a half a die in five and a half minutes. So let's go into game mode survival. Dash game mode survival. And you can make this bigger if you really want to. You can make this about one chunk big. That's about as long as it'll take until your thing starts screwing up. We have one level right now. Let's grab these levels. Ooh, that should give us some levels, right? Is that not how it works? I'd rather turn this off and then grab the levels. I I confused myself. I know what it has to do. I have to do this. I have to grab. You have to grab the die. Actually, but to grab die, so let's grab this die, and this will give me my levels. And come on, let's grab this die as well. Okay, never mind. Let's not grab the die. Pandy. Jesus. This. If you want to collect XP, you turn off your levels. You turn off the uh, others. So what you're going to do, you can just turn off these levers and they will, and you can stack this stuff up. I don't actually, you turn off the levers and you collect your die and then you can just turn them back on and I'll continue doing that. This is a simple way to get die, as you can see, and to also get level. So if you guys enjoyed that video, I still haven't changed that on my tapo skin, but if you guys enjoyed that video, make sure to smash that like button, hit subscribe, and I'll see you all later. Bye!